How to be an international spy with buns? Mr. James Buns. Step one, be suave. Very suave. Translation, cool. Very, very cool. Hmm? <laughs> oh, not to be confused with chilly or not hot, you understand, but cool. Step two, learn to lose your tail. Oh, not the one wiggling behind you, mind. The tail being the fellow following you. Okay? Ooh, looks like I really did lose my tail this time. Hmm, I am good. Whoa! And finally, step three. Master the art of disguise. You do not need me to explain this one, do you? Ah! <coughs> this only goes to show you cannot outwit buns. Mr. James Buns. This is your last chance. What is the answer? Uh, the barometric pressure of a gloomy day with a westerly rear flank upslope downdraft is... Six. You are correct. Oh, congratulations. You have just made the finals of the Gloomsville Town Challenge and a chance to win the coveted Big Brain. Ta-ta, Skullboy! He's the man. Excellent! <laughs> Ruby Gloom reporting live. With me is the man. Man, may I call you man? To what do you attribute your incredible success? Oh, is it brains? Oh, oh, no, 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 books? Is it books? I got it! Butter? None of the above, Ruby. I owe it all to this little baby. My lucky charm. It brings me luck. And you supply the charm, of course. <laughs> Jelly beans? Croquet! No, 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 armadillo! Ladies, enough tomfoolery, or <laughs> trish foolery, as it were. We must prepare for the finals. Oh, come on, Poe. Celebrate. Victory dance! Victory dance! Well, OK. I, I guess I could. <laughs> Phew. I'm beat. <clears throat> Time is of the essence. Where is Skullboy? Oh. Ah! Hail the conquering hero! Sorry I'm late, everybody, but I'm not in the mood for a party right now. Good chap! He doesn't want to party, he wants to practice. What dedication! What devotion! I can't practice either. What de... what? Why? What's the matter? The worst! My lucky charm! It's missing! And without it, I won't be able to get even one answer right! Are you sure? Believe me, without my lucky charm, I can't do anything! That's bad luck, and I would know. I gotta keep looking for it. Wait, why don't you let us help? Really? Well, sure. With all of us working together, we'll find it in a flash. That would be so great. And what, may I ask, are we looking for? A horseshoe. Well, that shouldn't be hard to spot. 
a seahorse horseshoe. Oh. For a baby seahorse. Oh. A baby miniature seahorse. Oh. oh. Okay, everybody, equipment check. Misery? Multidimensional rake! Check. Iris? Upside down finder mobile. Hey, come back, little guy. Oh, sorry. Check. Ho, check. Top of the line, lucky charm locator. I'm demanding my money back and a written apology. All checked and accounted for. Good. Now remember, shout if you find anything. What do you have there, Skullboy? A metal detector. It will detect metal up to 50 feet underground. Well, look, it's found something already. Whoa, in your bag. Metal classics of the 70s. It was a prize in my cereal box this morning. Ugh, my long-lost spring-loaded shoes. Oh, sorry. Found it! My great-great Nana's keepsake. A piece of the Hindenburg. <sighs> sorry. Found it! My long-lost Big Buffer 5000. Oh, I'm so delighted. <sighs> Oh, sorry, Skullboy, but worry not. We will find that lucky charm if it takes us until pigs fly. Hmm? Yeah! I'm never going to find it. Did Luella Fortin Horton give up on her quest to discover prunes? That's not a real person. You're right, but still. Uh huh. I've hit something. What is it? What is it? It's another metal detector. <sighs> Skullboy, as captain of this team, it is my duty to solve all problems that may arise. I know exactly what is required here. Great. What? Obviously, what we need is, um, well, some kind of solution. Yes. Uh, something extremely clever, yet deceptively simple. Um, yeah. oh, I know. Uh, let's, um, sleep on it. And no doubt the answer will arrive in, uh, due course. Uh. That's a great idea, Poe. It is? We put Skullboy to sleep and through hypnosis get him to recall where he used the charm. Um, yes. Uh, my idea exactly. You are getting sleepy. Very sleepy. Good. Now, I want you to think back to when you used the charm. Think back! Thinking, thinking. What did you find? That I really need my lucky charm! Skullboy? Skullboy? Oh, hi, Ruby. Come down. The team can't practice without you. You're the rock. Ruby, without my lucky horseshoe, I'm no rock. I'm more like a, uh, uh, <laughs> see? I can't even come up with a response. You don't need the charm. You need confidence. Come on, I'll show you. See, if I had my charm. To Skullboy, for the championship, what is the ectoplasmic consistency of a ghoulish specter? Um, uh, uh. That's an easy one. I have heard you answer that many times in the past. You can do it, Skullboy. I don't know, I don't know. Corduroy? Is that it? Corduroy? See? I'm no good without my good luck charm. I probably wouldn't even get my own name right. Go ahead, ask me. Uh, okay, Skullboy. 
What is your name, Skull Boy? Rufus. Donald? Eduardo. Norbert? Oh, oh, what am I going to do? Are you sure it's not Norbert? The great hurricane of 1780 happened in... Uh, I'm going out on a limb here, but I'm guessing... 1780? Yes! Misery, you are a machine! Misery? About my lucky charm. What do you think I should do? Stay away from the Caribbean during hurricane season. Uh... Bye. Iris, the big brain trophy is within our grasp. Now remember, you must hit the triangle before giving the answer. What? Bo Diddley! Iris, <laughs> you must wait until you hear the entire... Question? Yes. Yes! One right for Iris! Yes! Iris? Poe? What do you suggest I... Bo Diddley! Oh... Uh, yeah, thanks. I'll ask Ruby. Constantinople? Green tea? Squirrels? Deep down, you know what you have to do, Skull Boy. Oh, can you pass me the shrink wrap? Hmm... Shrink? Great idea, Ruby! <laughs> huh? So you see, Doc, I... I just don't know what to do. Skull Boy? We have here a very interesting pickle. Ow! Well, I can see that, Doctor, but what about my dilemma? You see, Skull Boy, the horseshoe is merely a symbol. What matters is the meaning you give it. You lose one, so you find another in which to invest meaning. Ow! Gee, thanks, Doc. Hey, you're really good at this. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, cash or check. No strudel. I'm watching my waistline. Bubonic plague? Misery. The category is things that taste yummy. Point being? Hey, guys! I found the solution to my problem. I just need another lucky charm. Any ideas? Sure, I have one. <clears throat> Better? Whenever I go through a door, I rub my hands on the doorknob four times. Brings me all kinds of luck. Try it, Skullboy. Uh, okay. <laughs> now ask him a question, Poe. From things that go smoosh. If I'm really steamed and I hit a wall, I will smoosh. <laughs> what am I? Uh, um, uh, bagpipes? Potato. I should have got that one. Skullboy, help me out here. What's a seven-letter word for a problem that's puzzling? Flummox. That fits. <laughs> Thanks. Other ideas? Come on, guys. I got one! These socks were worn by my great-great-great-granddad's great-great-grandma's great-uncle? <gasps> He caused the flood of 36, the fire of 53, and the broken ladder of 61. Gee, doesn't sound like it brought him much luck. He survived each of the disasters wearing these socks. Try him on! Go on, Poe. Ask him a question. Well, here's an easy one. What bone in your body laughs when you tell it a joke? Huh? Uh... Uh... The... The... Crossbone? No, the funny bone. The crossbone just gets really mad. See? Your grandfather's lucky socks can't even help me. Hmm. Maybe we should try his lucky underwear. No! No, that's quite all right. Thank you. Uh, hey, Skullboy. My horoscope said that if I were a woodchuck, today would be a great day for chucking wood. Which got me thinking. How much wood could I chuck if I were a woodchuck and I could chuck wood? <laughs> 7.8 chords. So, does anybody have any more ideas, huh? Huh? Um, here's one. Let's have a party. Great idea, Ruby. But, but how's that going to improve my luck? The Great Hall in half an hour. See you there. Hey, you forgot your socks. Ha, 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 ha.
<laughs> I gotta admit, he does look pretty funny. Yeah. By the way, I'm knitting a pair of pants for Gloomsville's oldest resident, and I can't remember if he has two legs, four legs, or more legs. Oh, that's easy. It's the old aardvark who runs the library. He's got four legs. And speaking of legs, lift them higher, Poe! If I were at the lowest point in Gloomsville, where would I be? <laughs> higher! The Blue Funk Canyon just north of Weeper Gulch. Here, here, let me show you. Woohoo! Rattle those bones, Skullboy! Skullboy, what's the root of a square tree? A square root. The color of a yellow blue horny toad? Gray. What's your name? Skullboy, of course. Not Rufus or Norbert. You know, Skullboy, you've been answering questions perfectly without the lucky charm. I think you're ready for the competition. <gasps> C c com competition Just treat it like the party. Have fun, and the answers will come. You really think that'll work? Absolutely. Have fun, and the answers will come. What is the answer? No, what's your answer? I asked you first. I asked you second. And second comes before first when you start third and count backwards. I'm ahead of you. Get it? Ahead. Your answer, Skullboy. <laughs> Whoa! The flute. Wrong. It all comes down to one final question. Time out. Time out. Skullboy, can I speak with you a minute? Oh, certainement, mademoiselle. Skullboy, what's going on? Well, I'm having fun. Are you really? No. In fact, I've never worked so hard at having fun. And it's killing me. When I said have fun and the answers will come, what I should have said was have fun, be yourself, and the answers will come. Of course, it doesn't rhyme as well. But I don't have my lucky charm. You don't need luck. You just need to be yourself. Lucky me? Exactly. <laughs> I've got to go. Good luck. I mean, you'll be great. The final question. The colloidal suspension of a plasmatic particle as expressed by a dog's bark is what? You have ten seconds to come up with an answer. Time is up. What is your answer? The answer is... <laughs> You are correct! Congratulations! You are the new Gloomsville Town Champions! All right! Well, not right! Yeah. See, Skullboy? You never lost your charm after all. You're the... The tops? The best? The champ? Correct. <laughs> All of the above. <laughs> That's got to be the heaviest brain around. Outside of Skullboys, of course. <laughs> Where should we put it? Well, everybody knows that for maximum good fortune, a brain trophy must be placed against the wall no more than 50 arms lengths from the doorway. You sure, Poe? I heard it was no more than 25 and perpendicular to the door. I heard you should keep it away from open flames, metal objects, and out of the direct line of any electrical currents. Skullboy, what's your opinion? Skullboy? Skullboy? Norbert? Okay, today is our first rehearsal with our new bandmate. Yeah, his name is Jack. Len, you're messing up the shot. Let's leave the camera work to me, okay? It's complicated. There, that's better. <laughs> now let's rock the first song, Jack! Okay, 
It's his first gig. He, uh, just needs to warm up. Come on, Jackie! Let's rock out this time! Yeah! Hit it! Len, I'm afraid somebody's not working out here. How could you fire me, Frank? I'm your brother. Jack! There you are. Let's play. Oh, Danny boy, the pipes, the pipes are coming. He was the best bandmate we ever had. You're not going to still fire me, are you, Frank? Huh. <sighs>